What's up guys and in today's video I'll be showing you how to make a core garden game in Roblox Studio. So in the episode the last episode we talked about how to make a growing system and in this episode uh, we're going to talk about how to make a stock system so as you know when you load up grower garden there is a stock and then every five minutes it changes so we're going to be making that now my gui is not that great so i'll just be making it really fast but the script is right there and i'll tell you what to change and what to not change so let's get started first open your explorer properties tab how by going to view and pressing these two then what we gotta do is make a script and serve a script server and uh, paste this script in the description down below so what this does is there's an information right here where we put our stuff why is this thing tweaking out so we put our information right okay my mouse is tweaking out so we put our information right here inside this table and my carrot has a chance of 0.5 so why didn't i put 50 percent so um 50 percent is 0 0.5 and like let's say five percent is 0 0.05 because 50 percent divided by 100 is 0 0.5 that's how you get the decimal of a percentage that's an important part for math um, now I put can be in stock which like how many it can go up to So right here we have our stock event where we have to make one so let's go to replicated storage and add a remote event Name the event exactly like this carrot stock event Now if you change the name and it's not this name then you can change it easy right here It's gonna kind of like pop up so like, you don't have to like you know just write it word like letter by letter so let's put this back and then we got to put another event and name it i don't know stock event this is you don't need to do this like if you have a f another fruit let's say you can change it to your uh fruit name because i didn't have two fruits i just named it i don't know because i don't know and then um what else we can change is the chance and you can also change the chance right here like if it's um if the random chance is smaller than 50 or equal to 50 then it'll run the code now please do not change these because it has to be just like this now what we're gonna do is let me just put a carrot see the back and replicate a storage you can also change this right here and uh you can name it to your tool so because mine is Bale. Bale. okay you can also change this and mine is named carrot seed so i put it as carrot seed your seed can be like name it whatever you want it's just after you have to put the tool in there and the name should be exactly this then it will put it inside the player dot backpack and if our main result which is like how many there is in the stock right now if it's um there's none then print nothing now it's going to do the same thing but this local random chance again is our second fruit so like um this is instead of being 50 as a 25 percent chance and it has a different chance so this is random chance two and this is random chance one and also if you want to put like the weight amount you can make a variable and you can name it like well, weight equals like weight and then an amount of time or you can already like put it here it's ready for you so i put as five just to make sure if it works or not Then what we have to do is go to start a GUI, add a screen GUI, add a, not a frame, my bad, add a, where is it, frame, scrolling frame, no. size it up, perfect, and then I'm going to add a frame, okay. it looks too white, 
can see this here now i'm just making it really fast so like you can change it whatever you want to doesn't matter uh, just like that. yeah perfect and then um we're gonna add a text label where it's gonna show like how many we have in stock let's change the color of this and then let's go here background transparency one and bold and we can put as jewel you can put as whatever it doesn't matter i'll just put it as come up i don't know how to say it and we can put this as left just like that then i'm gonna write stock boom uh, let me just quickly okay why is my mouse tweaking out I don't know why my mouse is tweaking out, but it's fine. Then I'm gonna add a text button. Again, you can change this to however you like it to. Like that. I'm gonna go all the way here, text scaled, and then name it by carrots. Bold. The same thing. Calum. Calum. And then I'm going to name, not name. So after we made the text button, we're going to add a local script. How? By pressing this plus icon right next to it. And then we have to paste this code in the description down below. Now, again, as you see, as we named that carrot, the remote event carrot stock event, it's right here as well. Now, if you have another event, your fruit is named another thing. Then just quickly change if your if your fruit is named another thing and you name your event as something else your fruit's name let's say then change this as well. Um, also, wait, wait, this is wrong. Okay, carrot seed, perfect. Now what this is is add my carrot seed. It will get the carrot seed and clone it. And yep, just like that. And then for our text, I think it's this one, yes. Uh, I'm gonna add a local script and paste this in the description down below. Um, okay, now what I forgot is a int value. You have to put this, if you don't, then it won't work. And we gotta name it stock value, just like this. Now put it as zero, it doesn't matter and let me name the frame as carrot frame and then i'll name this as i don't know frame because Okay, now that it's finished, um, what we can do is change this to like, I, I don't know, and yeah, okay, that's good, and then we're just gonna go in this text button, and instead of this, the stock, uh, we have this I don't know stock event, that's our second fruit, so I'm gonna put as that. And I already made it to um, just as my second, not actual second fruit, just to show y'all what I mean. And boom, just like that. And let me okay, this one name this stock script. Okay. Yep, this is perfect. And also for your second fruit, you can change this as well. I'm gonna like name them all what you can change and what you cannot so if it like if you see this and then like you can change then yeah you're allowed to change it so I'm gonna speed it up
and just to make it like close we can add a button Script local local button script button local frame script button button long frame button that must be that function oops and yeah oh. And now let's say we get some install. Okay, then now we have the carrot install. Let's just wait for the items. Okay, perfect. We buy them and let's close it up. I forgot to do it, but it doesn't matter. And as you see, these are our tools and it comes up. Thanks for watching and have a good day. Bye.